My name is Won Jin. I'm the designer of the Royal Mint Luna series of coins. And this year is the year of the dog. For me, the dog is very much um, a very wonderful companion animal. Um, they have a lot of energy and affection and loyalty. What really struck me about observing people with their uh, dogs is the real bond between them. There's a lot of affection and trust between them. Um, but I feel very much they sometimes mirror their owners. You can almost see the connection between them and that's really, really sweet. I'm always interested in depicting animals in motion. And I watched a lot of dogs from life running around and playing with each other. Um, and I'm happy that the movement and the energy of the dog is translated to the design in this coin. So I design coins by making um, a lino cut which involves carving into a substrate with a knife. And everything you carve away will print white, and everything you leave behind prints dark. So the energy that you put into carving these lines is a very similar kind of energy that comes out when you make a design in the coin. The design is um, a picture of a very happy, bounding dog that's jumping for joy. And um, it looks like it's smiling because he's kind of got his mouth slightly open, a big smile on his face. The background is actually created from a nose pattern of another dog. And the nose print is unique to every animal, every dog. So the nose print is um, a kind of portrait of another animal that this dog is potentially playing with. There are restrictions with working within a circular dimension but at the same time, there's a lot of freedom. So if you think about how we view the world, we actually view the world in a kind of circular way. There are no corners. So I think designing to a circle is something that's becoming more and more natural as I progress through the series. I'm always completely astounded by the work of the design team at the Royal Mint because they do an amazing job translating the design that I've made in 2D into a three-dimensional object. And I think this coin is very successful. They've done a good modeling of the body. So the dog really looks like he's moving through the air. And um, there's also a really nice blend of um, digital technology as well. The nose print looks a little bit like a biomorphic pattern or some kind of technological pixelation, which is a different visual language that also comes across very nicely on the coin. So I'm happy with the end result. The next coin is the year of the pig, which is the 12th animal in the lunar calendar.